Hey, this is Brett and today I am super excited to go over this brand new 2024 Jeep Wrangler four-door Rubicon. Now you might be saying, Brett, does this say Rubicon X? No, this is not a Rubicon X package. It is just a Rubicon package and it is stock number 24J190. But this Rubicon package does have some very nice options on it. I'll show you that on the original window sticker. I'll tell you what it's got though too. And uh, the window sticker is gonna be linked in the description below, but we'll check it out at the end of the video. But to start off, this one has the steel bumper and winch group, which gives you these steel bumpers. They are metal. You can remove these end pieces for better travel of the tires when your sway bars are disconnected. And it has an 8,000 pound worn winch from the factory on it. Um, and that comes with the steel bumpers and the winch. So that's one group that is on this vehicle. This one also has the hard top, which is an option. And it also has the 35 inch tire, extreme tire and wheel group. Now the extreme tire and wheel group is gonna give you these BF Goodrich all-terrain TAKO2 tires. These are LT315 70R17s. And it's gonna give you the painted and polished aluminum 17 by eight inch wheels. You also get a one inch increase on your sway bar link and an one inch increase on the springs in there. You also get performance brakes and it's gonna give you the 456 gears. Now because of those 456 gears, this 3.6 liter Pentastar V6 engine that pumps out 285 horsepower and 260 foot pounds of torque. That's paired up with the eight speed automatic transmission is gonna get you 19 miles per gallon highway, 16 city for an average of 17 miles per gallon. So they figure in those 456 gears into that fuel economy uh, for this particular Wrangler. Now you'll notice that you get these fender flare extensions on here as well, and that is to accommodate for the wider tires so that you're all legal like with highway and state road laws. 2024, they got rid of the antenna. You get a trail rated badge there now. They put the antennas in the windshield and these are all Corning Gorilla Glass on the Rubicon packages. You may have noticed that this one does have LED headlamps, running lights and fog lights. That's because these lights are now standard on the Rubicon package for 2024. You also get the rock rails on this one. Part of the Rubicon package, T50 on the doors. You need the Torx 50 bit to take those doors off. We did do a demo on how to take those doors off. If you want to check that out, that's in the upper right hand part of the screen and linked in the description below. The 35 inch tire and wheel group also gives you the sport brakes or the performance brakes back here. Got those slots in them. You can tell they're the performance brakes. You also get extensions on the rear tail lights. And they had to do that because these tires stick out so far and the taillights can only be so far from the very back of the vehicle. So they had to do a one inch extension in the ex extensions so that they put them on the right side, say Ralph or right. It's a dog there. You also get the hinge gate reinforcement. And then on the left, you get Louie. He is a bulldog. And you'll notice that the tail lamps are LEDs as well. You get the towing package standard on the Rubicon. So if this one didn't have the 35 inch tire and wheel group, you could pull 5,000 pounds with it, but because of the 456 gears that you get with this tire and wheel group, um, the tow rating is not as high. I believe it's only 3,500 pounds, but you do get the receiver hitch, four pin and seven pin wiring on there. Oh, here's a, a copy of the original window sticker. This one comes with two window stickers. Like I said, we'll get to this in just a little bit. It's also linked in the description below. This is a uh, front bumper license plate holder. This is a case for the front hard top pieces. As far as that hard top goes, you get three bolts on each side, two on the top, and two quick disconnects to take this hard top off. We did a demo on how to take your hard top off of your Jeep Wrangler. That is in the upper right hand part of the screen and linked in the description below. Another little Easter egg, you get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven slots on the back door. You get the JL badge on every Wrangler. Two door, four door with the wheelbase and overall length, as well as water fording and the distance between the outside 
and middle of the tires. You get where it was made, developed, and built in. These doors still close all the same way. You get the black fuel door on there. One kind of interesting thing, you may have been wondering, what are these kind of trapezoid looking things on the windows? So this is how Wranglers come when they're shipped. These come in there so that these back windows don't blow out during shipping. Um, don't know why they would do that, but they put them in there. To get them out, just turn them. They pop out like so, and that's what they look like. Um, our road ready guys forgot to take them out on this one, so you get to see what they are. Bonus for watching this video. The things you learn. Anyways, this one has the enter and go system. You just have to have the key fob in your pocket. It'll automatically unlock. You get the heated mirrors. Now the Rubicon package comes with the, they call it black cloth interior. I think it's charcoal, more of a gray, dark gray. Latch child safety system back here. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Also, put the seat belt on. And uh, those seats, they go down really nice and flat, which is great if you have to haul a bunch of extra stuff. And then they go back up like so. These headrests stay down, so better visibility if nobody's riding back here. You also get two USBs, two USB-Cs, 115 volt, 150 watt plug-in back here and two cup holders, air vents, and window controls. New for 2024 are the side curtain airbags right there. Made those standard on all the Wranglers, which is really nice. And because they put those in, they had to kind of rearrange how the speakers went in there, and they also had to rearrange the LED map lights, child safety locks on the back doors. I'm not gonna go through too much of the interior. We'll just check out these front seats here. Uh, you get the Rubicon stitched into the backrest with the red stitching. Tire and loading information sticker. I normally don't show this on the videos, but there you go. This one does have the driver's seat height adjuster, lumbar manual adjust there. You get the Wrangler and the Gladiator backed up to each other. That is new for 2024. Auto headlamps, tilt telescopic steering wheel. You get this kind of Gore-Tex material, I think they call it. A uh, red metal piece right there, and then the red stitching. And then you get power locks, power mirrors. Seven inch LCD display, Rubicon animation at the beginning there. And you get the digital speedometer, compass, um, fuel gauge, all that good stuff. You can change all those corners to read pretty much whatever you want. This one has the heated leather wrap steering wheel. And the heated steering wheel is part of the convenience group on this one. Adaptive cruise control, regular cruise control, Bluetooth information center controls, and audio controls in the back of the steering wheel. Get that really nice soft touch leather uh, steering wheel with the red stitching, the Gorilla in the windshield, part of that Corning Gorilla glass. And this is the Uconnect 5 12.3 inch touchscreen radio. So this radio is the standard radio in all of the Wranglers. Even the sport package gets this 12.3 inch touchscreen. The only main difference is that some of them come with nav and some of them don't. This one does not come with the navigation system. You get all your different apps here. Uh, and basically these are just links to everything else in the radio. So you can see these mimic what's going on over here. Android Auto, Apple CarPlay, vehicle settings, get off-road uh, pages on here. Just get your rear view mirror camera, rear view camera, and then the off road pages. Are not loading. There they are. You get your steering angle, which if I turn the steering wheel, they change. Sway bar link if it's connected or disconnected. Those tires also turn as well when I turn that steering wheel. Transfer case if it's locked or unlocked. Rear axle, front axle if it's locked or unlocked. You get latitude, longitude, and altitude on their accessory gauges and pitch and roll. So a lot of really cool stuff that you can do with this radio. You also get the system and other. And then the radio itself, you get AM, FM, and Sirius XM radio capabilities, as well as USB and AUX jack hookups. And then, of course, your climate controls are right here as well. Heated seats, heated steering wheel controls there too. 
more tactile volume tune and climate controls down here, including the heated seats and steering wheel buttons. Start stop capability, stability control, that's your speed select crawl control. Down here, you get a media center for a USB, USB C, and AUX jack. Four auxiliary upfit switches, so you can put aftermarket lights and stuff and hook them up to those buttons. They're basically just like light switches, just buttons. Sway bar disconnect, off road plus mode, and you get a front and rear locking axle or just a rear locking axle. This right here is what makes a Rubicon a Rubicon. Eight speed automatic transmission, four by four shifter right there. Keyless entry with the remote start, and you get the flipper key on there. Nice chunky key fob. So that is that. That is everything with this Wrangler. You also get assist and SOS buttons up there and home link buttons for your garage door security systems and lighting systems. And you can see the different placement on those lights up there. All the quick disconnects to get that hard top off. Pretty easy to do and it goes really quick. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna do a final walk around with all the lights on on the outside of the vehicle and then turn all the lights off in the picture studio so you can see just how bright they are. We will finish up with going and looking at that original window sticker, go through everything on it. Once again, if you don't want to go through all that, it's linked in the description below. So let me pause it here. We'll turn the lights off, do a final walk around, check out that window sticker and we'll be all set to go. All right, you can see just how bright those lights are. I really, really like the LED lighting group on the Wranglers, always have, always thought it was a great addition uh, whenever somebody had added it to the Wranglers. Now they make them standard, and the reason is because it is just a superior lighting system to the old halogen bulbs. Uh, everything is much brighter, everything is much of a much whiter of a light, and you get a wider spectrum of light from each side there. Uh, very nice job that Jeep has made those standard. Pretty much across the trim levels, only the Sport package cannot get them. Uh, Sport S package can get them as an option. LED tail lamps, you get that hourglass shaped design on there. And the LED license plate lights as well. So let's go take a look at that original window sticker. Thank you so much for checking out the video. Let's go check it out. So here is the original window sticker, the 2024 Wrangler four-door Rubicon 4x4. And black clear coats of color, black interior. See, they call it black. It's definitely charcoal. Cloth, low back bucket seats. 3.6 liter V6 24 valve VVT engine with start-stop. Eight-speed automatic transmission. Everything on your left here is your standard equipment. Feel free to pause it. Then your optional equipment starts with the black clear coat, which is $595. The steel bumper and winch group is a $3,495 option. 24R is the Rubicon package. And uh, the extreme 35-inch tire, tire package is a $4,495 option. You get the 456 gears, the 17 by 8.5 or 8-inch machine wheels with black pockets the LT315 70R17 BFG tires, the hinge gate reinforcement by Mopar. Now what they don't tell you is you get that lift, you also get the sport brakes, and you also get the fender extensions on there. So it's not just that stuff, but I do like that they now tell you that you get the 456 gear ratio. Convenience group is 995. That's probably the most economical group of them all. You can see the heated seats, heated steering wheel, and remote start. Eight-speed automatic transmission is a $4,500 upgrade, but that gives you the adaptive cruise control as well. Three-piece hard top is $1,695, gives you the rear window defrost, wiper, and washer, and it does not have a soft top. Gives you the Freedom Panel Storage Bag. Total MSRP is $68,965 to get your summit price with all the rebates and incentives on this particular Wrangler in the upper right hand part of the screen is a link to our website also linked in the description below. Now if it says sold in the title of this video, this vehicle is sold. If it doesn't say sold in the title, there's a good chance this vehicle is still available for sale. 3 year 36 bumper to bumper, 5 year 60 powertrain, 19 highway, 16 city for an average of 17, they're your greenhouse and smog ratings and it's only rated for a three-star rollover. Anyways, that is the whole vehicle. Let me know what you think in the description or in the comments below. And to see more pictures of this Jeep or one of our other 550 new and used cars, trucks, SUVs, 
minivans, specifically Wranglers, go to that website right there, summitauto.com, full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle, all at summitauto.com. If you want to check out more HD videos, you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto, click the bell notifications, get updates on the videos I do each and every day, as well as having access to one of the largest catalogs of vehicle and specifically Wrangler walkarounds on YouTube, over 9,000 videos on my YouTube channel and over 500 specifically Wrangler videos just like this one and it's updated every day, so subscribe, get updates every time I do a video so you can see our current inventory that's always changing here at Summit Automotive. In fact, in a second, you will see a link to subscribe to my YouTube channel in the upper left, a link to all the Wrangler videos I've ever done in the upper right, a link to how to take your hard top off your JL Wrangler in the lower left, and a link to how to take your doors off your JL Wrangler in the lower right. Click those, check us out, like, subscribe, and share, and thank you so much for checking out the video. We really look forward to helping with this brand new 2024 Jeep Wrangler Rubicon with the 35 inch tire and wheel group, convenience group in black clear coat and the steel bumper and winch group. Thank you so much for checking out the video. Remember to like, subscribe and share on the YouTube channel. I really appreciate it. Thanks again.